everybody, welcome to Next Stop Thailand. And today, this morning, we are at the Suwanapum Airport. And today, I will be showing you how to get to the Racha Resort, which is on Racha Island. Now, Racha Island is located off the southern part of uh, Phuket Island, and um, you see step by step how to get there. So, we've just boarded the airplane from Suwanapum Airport in Bangkok, and of course, from Air, uh, from Bangkok to Phuket is literally just like an hour um, airplane ride. You're gonna be paying, I mean, 4,000 baht, 5,000 baht, which is like 100 something US dollars uh, for a quick flight to Phuket Island. And once you arrive at the Phuket Airport, all you do is just find the airport limousine, and it's a good 800 baht for you for them to take you from the uh, Phuket Airport to the pier in which you're going to be board, boarding on the speedboat to travel to Racha Island. So we're just sitting in the car now, and as you can see, Phuket is beautiful. It's a lot of greenery, it's a lot of trees, um, quite quiet and quite tranquil actually. And now we've arrived at the pier. Now this pier is called um, Pier Chalong. Now the word Chalong in 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 uh, Thai means celebrate. So perfect uh, place to come, you know, and begin your celebration on vacation. So what I'm going to now is I'm just traveling, going to the check-in office of the Racha Resort. And um, what's actually really cool is that uh, across the uh, uh, office of the um, check-in, um, it's just a 7-Eleven. Now, if you haven't been to an island or you haven't stayed on an island before, I highly recommend stop by 7-Eleven. Pack yourself with drinks, sodas, beer, chips, snacks, tons of stuff that you can Think you can find just load yourself up with all these snacks um, before you get on the speedboat to the island because once you're on the island guys I mean you're just you're just stuck there is not you know there's no 7-eleven um, all you have is the hotel food so get a lot of goodies and candies and chocolate as much as you need before you go on the speedboat so right now we're in front of the check-in office and um, you can see that they've just started loading our bags onto the bus and I'm just walking into the hotel this is actually the hotel lobby now the Raja Resort is on the Raja Island but the check-in office is actually located on on the pier so it's actually really cool so you actually uh, you know take the bus take the sorry take the taxi from the airport to the pier and just walk across next door to this um, check-in office and you actually check in your name um, get your room number and you check in all your baggage here first get all that done and then they take you onto the speed build onto the Raja Island. So that's that's actually I think that's really cool and really convenient for I think new travelers uh, travelers and new guests. So now it's time to get onto the speedboat. So they've just told us to just quickly go on the bus here. So they've arranged um, um, a few buses here to take the guests from the uh, in front of the office to the um, site where they have the speedboat part. So we're just getting on here and going for I think for probably a, just a quick ride. Now the ride from the airport to the pier is actually, you know, it's 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 a nice ride. It's very scenic, a lot of streets that you saw before. So it's about a good 45 minutes ride. So from that, you see, we took an hour plane ride from Bangkok to Phuket. Another 45 minutes from the airport, riding on the taxi to this pier here. And this ride was just was just another quick um, five minutes, uh, two minutes actually from the pier down to where we're gonna see the speedboat. So. Here now, okay. So we've uh, gone off, gone down from the bus here, and this is actually the speedboat of the resort. Now, if you if you haven't been to Thailand before, it's your first time coming to the island or going on the island. I highly recommend you take the speedboat off the hotel. I mean, it's just the safest. Racha Resort is a very trustworthy resort, a very, a very well-known resort. So the transportation, the very range is a very nice transportation. Um, as you can see, the speedboat is nice and big. They have a light vest, a lot of space. Um, it's a very wide speedboat, so it's not going to be rocky, even though there's maybe little waves in the ocean. So, the worst thing you want to do is you don't want to just, you know, come down here and just hire a local speedboat to just go. I mean, um, if you honestly, if you if, if the hotel is on the island, they should have proper transportation of the hotel for you to get from the pier to the island. So, I mean, don't 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 take your chance with just a local speedboat. The speedboat might be small, it might not be safe. So, so you spend the extra the extra bucks to. Take the speedboat, take the, the transportation of the hotel and of the resort. So we're just on cruising down the ocean here. Now from the pier to the island, I believe is only about you know another 45 minutes. So within the uh, the time span of about two to three hours, you can get from you know the clustered city of Bangkok to this wonderful, amazing paradise. 
which is Raja Island. And of course, the Raja Resort is one of the nicest resorts on Raja Island. And we're just arriving at the port of the resort now. So basically, the speedboat just just stops onto um, a bridge, a floating bridge, in which you just walk on into the resort. As you can see, when we've uh, arrived at this bay area of the resort, the water is just beautiful and it's, it's just glistening with blue and brightness of the ocean floor. And this time, of course, Phuket, the water is crystal clear. It's even almost literally the clarity of a swimming pool and you can just see right straight to the bottom of the ocean here. See the sand, see the coral, see all the fish swimming literally from just the boat. And seeing, seeing this, honestly guys, I literally just want to just jump in and just, just take a dip and just get all refreshed. This is just completely wonderful. It's a beautiful day. The sun is out and shining. I mean, you can just see, just look through and just notice that water. I mean, how, how beautiful, how nice is that water, guys? That is just so cool. Okay, so we've arrived at uh, the Raja Resort. I'm just dropping off, getting down that now from the, the speedboat now. Uh, and there's, of course, this really cool, I mean, it's, it's actually a really cool floating bridge that they have here to connect you from the speedboat to the hotel. And you can see here, it's just, it's pool water. It's literally pool water, crystal clear water I'm just ready to uh, take a dip so I hope you guys have enjoyed this video um, and um, of how to get from Bangkok to the Raja Islands and do please stick around in the next few videos I'll be showing you my experience what I've done at this wonderful uh, resort here and uh, there's just gonna be many things on marine life and all the adventures I've had spending this next two three days at the resort here so thank you as always for tuning in and we'll see you at the next stop